All right, hey you guys, what is going on? GI Geo Gamer here, and today we are back with some StarCraft 2. I've been back from vacation. This is a game I've been playing for a couple weeks now, and I figured let's go ahead and jump into uh, a video of it. I'm going to be playing some 1v1 ranked. Uh, I am Platinum League Tier 2, currently rank 30. I play the Zerg race. There's three races, Terran, Zerg, and Protoss, each having their different pros and cons. Um, personally, Zerg is for me. It's the one I like. It's the one I play with. So, um, yeah, I figured let's do a video on it. Um, now, my computer is currently seeming to have a lot of issues with OBS for no apparent reason. Um, so, what I've been trying to work on is getting it to work like right now it's recording at 10 fps when i have plenty of cpu and um you know like my computer is still running perfectly fine not using too many resources but uh anyway let's wait for this to get us going in here and uh yeah we can really start cranking on some starcraft game is ready all right nice here we go it's 4.20 p.m. <laughs> Alright, Zerg v Zerg. <coughs> Zerg, Zerg, Zerg. Alright, so this guy apparently is Zerg Ultralisk. He's very Zerg heavy, apparently. Let's see if we can't just beat him. My average APM, I believe, is like 115. Um, my current, I would say my current main weakness is... Um, honestly, my current weakness is probably... Phone. All right. I would say my current weakness, most likely, is just the uh, running creep. Uh, as a Zerg, you know your queens can spread creep. I'm not exactly the best at it, but um, if this game wants to go ahead and start. That would be nice. We're cranked up to 30 FPS again. All right. This is good. Maybe game well I'm gonna text sir back then this game ain't gonna start as you can see we're waiting for this guy right here so if you look at this bar that's his internet like that's how much he's loaded into the game so he probably has a slow computer nothing I can do about that as you can see we are already loaded in we're just waiting for him Oh, 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 here we go, here we go. Alright, we need to get that one second drone started. Come on. Alright, StarCraft is a real time strategy. It's an RTS, um, sci fi, I guess you could say. Um, now, I don't claim to be a pro at this whatsoever. This is just how I play, how I've learned. All right, we do the extractor trick to get two extra drones. Get our overlord going, flying out to watch his uh, natural. Um, all right, now we just drone up. We're maxed out on drones in this base. Let's head down. All right, deliver those minerals. Head down to take the base. Come on, get down here. All right, take that extra base get that uh, worker to replace it uh, now last game I actually went for uh, normally you go hatch gas pool hatchery uh, gas uh, spawning pool but I personally prefer to do the spawning pool first uh, just a just a personal preference but I just feel like having those extra few zerglings in the beginning of the game is very efficient. I win all my games pretty much in under 10 minutes because I cannot play late game. I, I don't claim to be good at late game. I'm not good at late game. So, uh, oh, return those. All right, Zerg v Zerg, that's his thing. We get this pull up, we can get a queen down to push back that, um, to push back that which gall we can push back what am I trying to say that overlord so spawning pool is up we got our queen inbound 
to get two oh whoops see i i also am really bad with my overlords i do not pay enough attention to them i don't know it's kind of you know a mistake that i make often but it is what it is let's get our queens out be able to run those injects two batches of zerglings following up this we got our drone set here all right another overlord i want you to go watch the third all right now that we have 100 gas we can start working on uh zerg uh link speed now let's see if he sends that overlord in all right, he's keeping it right there. That's smart of him. Uh, you know, that's where mine is at the moment, on his side of the map. All right, get those injects going. I want you more like right there. All right, and now we need to get across this map and get scouting. Let's get that uh, our lair, our lair, in just a minute. All right. And then normally at this point I already have you and you. All right, there's the double overlord. He'll see us coming. Let's see how many links he has personally. Oh, he's going roaches. All right. So as you can see, he's already got roaches. We need to get our roach worn down. Uh, we'll keep these links right around here just for you know to watch. All right, let's get that gas up if we're gonna be running roaches. Uh, honestly, we probably wanna do that. Again, just watching our injects. All right, a few more lings down there just to keep things rolling. Um, now, since we're going roaches, I'm not even gonna get Zerg attack. Just skip right over that. Uh, alright. You there. You there. Now, because we're going roaches, I, I took the double gas. I feel like that was a smart decision. Now we gotta get these roaches rolling. Oh, I forgot my lair. I, I honestly forget lairs. Like, I, I just don't do it. I forget about it all the time. And then, you know, halfway into the game and I'm like, oh, I can't get any upgrades. I wonder why. Oh, wait, I didn't do any of my main upgrades. Uh, my main layer upgrades. All right. I don't like the fact that he can see all of my troops moving out, but I can't exactly do anything about it. Alright, we need a few more overlords going down there. Alright, ooh, he's spreading creep. Let's just go ahead and shut that down. Alright, yep, he's got a good amount of roaches. Pretty much all we're watching right now. Overlords, can you guys come out, please? Alright, he's pushing. He's going Roach Ravager already. Alright, this could be bad, ladies and gentlemen. We need to make sure we got all of our injects running. All right, as many troops cranking out as we can. Our upgrade should finish uh, pretty soon, which will, uh, oh wait, what did I just do? What am I morphing? I don't need to morph anything. Uh, I'm gonna go Hydra Den. Alright, let's start moving out. I I don't like this overlord, but there's nothing I can do about it. So let's just start moving out slowly but surely. Let's clean this out. Alright, Minerva Field de depleted. Let's get those down there. Alright. Let's just see where his army Alright, again, I kind of want to hide, you know, where we are. Alright, we're still recording at 30 FPS, which is good. Let's get these upgrades going. 
get a couple ravagers made. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's see if he took his third, if he, he pro wait, nope. Overlord already has that scouted, never mind. Alright, so, let's just grab a few more ravagers. I feel like he's gonna have a good amount of them. Grab some hydras. Alright, we require more Vespine gas. Just get those morphing. Alright, again. Get some more overloads sent out back there. Did I say overloads? Overlords. Alright, get this last ravager going and let's just push in. Alright, I think we got this. Yeah, we got this for sure. Oh yeah, easy win. Easy win. Simply overpowered him in this one. He's going Hydras. He's too late. We're going to take those out, and he's going down. Let's just wait for this GG. There we go. That's our first ever StarCraft video on the channel. Um, he didn't even GG out. He just quit. Hmm. All right, let's see how we did. I feel like my APM was all right. 120 APM. Not bad, not bad. Uh, again, I'm supply ca capped for way too long. Good amount of workers created. Nice. Um, I'm gonna go just watch this replay real fast. I'll let you guys come along, and because I like to watch all of my replays, especially when the opponent is Zerg, uh, and see what we did different, what mistakes were made. Um, does the replay really make us wait that long? Okay, I was gonna say, um, we're dropping FPS again. I'm not really understanding this, but anyway. Uh, let's just do into this So this is his point of view. So at this point All right, he went pool first interesting He went pool. Yeah pool gas Whereas we went hatch uh, Pool gas Hatch gas. Pool. Uh, they're essentially at the same time All right, he saw my overlord We're moving out. All right. What did he just throw down? Is that his roach for him? Okay, so that he threw out his bleh, threw down his roach warren right at the beginning. Got his queen out, started spreading creeps. Got his second hatchery. At this point, we already have our zerglings and basically uh, our natural half maxed out. His main isn't maxed, and his natural has no drones. He's got four roaches. We ran in, scouted the roaches, immediately threw down our bane, uh, not our bane nest, our roach warren. Uh, we were able to. See that he's throwing down um, What is it called spine crawlers? Yeah, he's throwing down a lot of spine crawlers not really sure what the point of that is to be honest with you uh, Whatever he wants to do I suppose So he's just massing roaches. He's really not droning up if we go ahead and look at production He's just throwing down roaches and upgrades um, Yeah, like I massed a lot of roaches right here, you know, I got my army ready even now, I have a bigger army than he does because his economy is so weak. Uh, I just look at that. Look at that. Um, look at the that supply. Ninety-eight to sixty-seven. We at this point had the army advantage. Snuck around past his overlord. He didn't expect this coming. Uh, he's just throwing down spawn crawlers. I think he knows. Oh wait, he saw my zerglings there, and we just pushed in. All right, let's slow this down. We pushed in. Chucked down a bunch of um, a bunch of corrosive vile and wiped out his whole army. Pushed in, took an easy victory. Honestly, I would say that is not too bad, ladies and gentlemen. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like. I'm curious how StarCraft will do on the channel. Um, I enjoy it. Real time strategy. It's a good game. Sixty dollars on uh, Blizzard. Be sure to go check it out. There's a free version if you're in interested in trying. Uh, gives you full access to most of the game um, and the first few missions in the campaign. Um, I also might do a campaign walkthrough, not sure on that. Wish I could figure out what's wrong with OBS's FPS, but anyway, guys, if you did enjoy, I'll definitely see you in the next one. Goodbye.